This week in Outer Athletics, I sit down with men's head soccer coach Rob Cummings. Hey Rob, thanks for being with us. Hey, thanks for having me. You know, you're back in California, you're on the West Coast, and you're here in the Monterey Peninsula with the Otters. How is that for you? It feels great to be back in, um, you know, California. I made the comment to my assistant as we went to the Surf Cup that the last time I was in this area, I was a player, you know, down there. And to come back as a coach, I mean, just tell you, A, you know, how much time has gone by. Uh, but also, it's just excitement. Soccer hasn't changed. It's gotten better here. I mean, when I left, it was one of the top states in soccer from top to bottom, and it continues to be that and get even stronger. And now you come here to Monterey Bay. I think location, everything we have here at the conference, I'm just excited about everything and the possibilities here in Monterey. You know, you've had great success as a coach. Coming from Midwestern State where you had four Lone Star Championships and two Final Four appearances, what are you going to do bringing that success here to Otter Soccer? Yeah, you know, come from Midwestern State University, you know, I, w I was blessed, you know, in, in four years to go to the NCAA tournament, four straight years, into two Final Fours and three Elite Eights. Um, you know, one thing I take away from there and at the, my 11, 12 years of college coach as a head coach and assistant is that it's the little things. It's the little things that, you know, taking pride in your equipment, uh, making sure things are done right from my end and on the player's end. And I just believe, you know, from my experiences at Midwestern State, you know, we had great athletes, but we just did all the little things. We came in, we did it right, we bought into the system, we worked hard day in, day out. Uh, we did the stuff in the classroom we had to do to make sure everybody was taken care of. So my, my goal is to bring that approach here. You know, you guys really took a step in the right direction, uh, moving from last year's game against San Jose State to this year, big difference in the game. Now you're going ahead and you're going to play San Francisco State. What do you take from San Jose State? San Francisco State this weekend. What San Jose State brought is allowed us to kind of gauge where we're at. Um, you know, they're a good quality Division One program. I mean, they've got some great players that number 20 is as fast as you're going to find in this conference. So it gave us a good benchmark, um, something to build off. And now, you know, as we get into San Francisco State, you know, the, some of the mistakes we're making against them, we just got to get it a little cleaner. Um, I think if we do that, I mean, we'll, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna have success in this conference. You know, I never, I always tell the kids, you can't always equate wins and losses, but we will be organized, we will be disciplined, we'll be ready to go for Central State and East Bay in that weekend, and, and I'm excited, and so are the kids.